Hello, and welcome to a CISSP micromodule on symmetric cryptography. Symmetric cryptography can also be called shared key or secret key cryptography. It achieves the service of confidentiality. Let's illustrate how symmetric cryptography works. Let's assume that Alice has a recipe that she wants to share with her friend Bob, but she's afraid that someone might intercept her message. Alice is going to use an algorithm to manipulate the data to generate ciphertext. To do this, she will use a key, which is a random value that's put into an algorithm. In order to decrypt the ciphertext, Bob needs the exact same key. With symmetric systems, oops. With symmetric systems, Alice will have to share the key with Bob in what's called an out-of-band method. The main problem with symmetric cryptography is that key exchange is hard, and it must be done using another method. Again, this is referred to as out-of-band. Here is the formula for calculating the number of symmetric keys needed for a symmetric cryptosystem. The number of keys is n times n minus 1 divided by 2. For example, if you have 50 users, it would be 50 times 50 minus 1, or 49, divided by 2, which would mean 1,225 symmetric keys would be needed. The reason this is an issue is because it's not scalable. Thank you for watching. If there are any questions, comments, or corrections, please leave them in the comments box below.